hello friends um, today we are going to review this new cooler from anti sports i tried to find uh, reviews in youtube and i didn't get anyone who is reviewing this box when i was recording this video so today i'll try to demonstrate unbox sit and see what are the contents inside how is the quality of this product okay so let's get started so as you can see so the leds are on uh, the circular shape and not in the middle and there is a full plate which is uh, illuminating the lights and in center there is a temperature uh display which will show the cpu temperature so in this video we are just going to unbox it and see the contents of it and in another video i am going to show you the installation process and then uh, how it performs so is a 240 mm radiator so you can see it's coming with 3 uh, years of warranty and this is the back side of it so you can see Let's open it. I have purchased it this from Amazon, and previously also I purchased other coolers from Anti Sports. but it seems uh, we are getting used product as well uh, but amazon uh, helped me to replace my older ones so my older coolers has been replaced but i didn't took the uh, the original replacement uh, i again bought a new one so the older one i just returned it and i got the refund be careful while ordering online people i i saw that somehow people is uh, misusing this seal it can be easily opened and again resealed it is very easy also the uh, uh, this um, plate the back of the plate people can also remove that sticker and again repaste it so please be careful So we are getting this here. You can read it how to install this cooler. And this seems um, uh, the quality of uh, the diagram and other stuff seems new to me. Maybe they have upgraded something in the coolers. Let's see. So we'll open it later. First, check the main product. Then I'm just opening up. So uh, the good thing is they have already uh, put the fans inside it. Okay. and uh, it's a very nice looking one so you can see it 
it looks um, uh, it is not uh, any um, um, LED LED what we see LED uh, uh, LED plastic that illuminates light it is not like that it is something different the color looks like a uh, golden brown something like that that this side the okay and you can see uh, copper plates and it's uh, it's really large one the other anti sports um, which comes around 4000 rupees i saw like it is uh, not that large but this one is really a large one this cable is braided cable and you can see it is much larger so you can put it anywhere i mean it's really large and the quality of the fans are also i mean really nice so the last one which i received i ordered a 360 mm radiator anti sports cooler there is a hole inside this plate somebody tried to screw it on these places and they have damaged this uh, lines so there are two two lines which uh, one flows the hot water i mean the liquids inside it so it's a mix of water and some solution i don't remember and in another place it cools it down and takes the water back to here and uh, keeps the cpu i mean yeah temperature cool so this is the product and this is uh, made of like glass uh, sorry plastic transparent plastic okay so this is how it looks like also now you can see if i show you the plugs so there are three plugs so this one i'm getting one uh, argb argb connector you can see and you need to uh, you need to put uh, this into your uh, p uh, motherboards uh, 5 volt argb connector only and do not put it on the 12 volt 4 pin uh, header it will damage your leds so make sure you put it only uh, to the 5 volt uh, header given in your motherboard and these are AR argb so all the lights have uh, multiple colors in it then yeah so there is interesting uh it is having one usb uh port as well so from your motherboard's usb header so you have to i mean sacrifice one usb 2.0 unless you haven't put it in the front panel of your cabinet so you have to use one usb 2.0 if you want to show the Uh, i think this is for the data display so that it gets the uh, temperature uh, output and show it in the panel so i think that's why they have given this uh, usb uh, connector and the third connector it has uh, one uh, for the pump cooler so it's a three pin pump cooler so you can install it in your uh, i mean four pin fans also or three pin if you have so it will go inside those and you in your cpu in your motherboard uh, you should have um, the uh, cpu fan header uh, install it there in my case i have a asus stuff motherboard i have a dedicated uh, this for a pump so i'll install it into the pump header and then for the fans you have connectors i'll show you those so uh, so basically you'll get two types of wire here one is for rgb 
So this one you can see same ARGB you can see so it has both I mean all the wires have both male and female connector so that you can extend your um, ARGB wires together if you have other fans also and if you don't have uh, connector in your motherboard I mean you have only one connector so you can put it all in a series like that and connect the last one into your motherboard and finally uh, this one uh, the power cable for the fans uh, you can insert it to your motherboard fan header also if you have available ports or uh, there is a uh, uh, SATA connector I could see no uh, so so I don't see a SATA connector but they have mentioned outside the box that they have provided a SATA connector output so if you don't have any pins available you can use that SATA connector for the output I will just show you the box over here what are the contents of it so I am removing now these items so in this box they have provided they should have provided all those contents let us see what the contents are available uh, yes so you can see uh, they have provided this SATA connector but I can see this is for uh, RGB only ARGB only so that means um, if you want to power up your ARGB through directly uh, from uh, your SMPS you can do it and you can uh, control this RG ARGB even if your motherboard uh, does not have any ARGB headers so you can power it up directly from here then uh, I can see that uh, this uh, this is the Intel backplate uh, this quality from other anti sports cooler also I didn't like I mean it's it's like plastic okay so um, very very lightweight I don't know how it will perform in the long run maybe once you have installed it don't regularly open or I mean assembled it, assembled it because it's a very lightweight material I don't know how long it will uh, stay this is for the Intel one and uh, I think these are the AMD brackets they have provided I am not sure whether the uh, original AMD backplate ones are will work or not but by default uh, then uh, AMD uh, the default ones what we receive in the motherboard they support it so in the next video when I'll do the installations and all I'll show you whether uh, I need these brackets for AMD or not then we are getting this um, anti sports uh, uh, thermal paste nothing mentioned about its uh, specification like there is some 14.5 some parameters are there I forgot the term which describes how much uh, conductivity non -con I mean uh, uh, it can it can support uh, I think the max one uh, how much bigger the number is it uh, have much more uh, I mean uh, reduce in the thermal then finally we are having all these screws they have mentioned Okay, nothing else. 
so that's it guys um, I don't do the reviews uh, uh, in YouTube but uh, because this uh, product is not available in YouTube and um, I thought people might need to know what they are receiving from this uh, anti sports new cooler that's why I have posted it uh, encourage me so that I can make uh, new videos for you thank you so much please like